Visual floaters are objects that drift around in the field of vision. They may look like little blobs or cobwebs that shift around with eye movement and is impossible to focus on. Floaters are in fact particles suspended inside the vitreous body. What we see however, are not the floaters themselves, but the shadows they cast on the retina. Floaters usually develop with age when the gel-like vitreous body undergoes syneresis, a process in which water is separated from solid components creating pockets of fluid. These fluid pockets are perceived by the patient as blobs or little worms. Protonaceous collagen fibrils within the vitreous can become denatured and clumped together which create the floating strings or cobwebs. The fluid pockets may collapse, causing the vitreous to shrink and pull away from the retina. When this happens, the pulling mechanically stimulates the retina and triggers light flashes in the peripheral vision. When the vitreous body completely separates from the retina, this is known as posterior vitreous detachment or PDD. PDD is very common and is generally benign requiring no treatment. Unfortunately, in a small number of cases, as the vitreous detaches, it may pull the retina with it, causing a retinal tear. Fluid from the vitreous may then slip through the tear and cause the retina to separate from the underlying tissue. This is known as retinal detachment and may cause permanent visual loss. Worrying signs to watch out for include a sudden increase in number of tiny new floaters or development of a visual shade, a sign of vision loss from the detached part of the retina, 